guys, welcome back. Today we're going to be reviewing a book, a children's book. Now, <laughs> before you're like, nah. this is like a lovely book, guys. I am really, <laughs> I'm so into reading and I just think that kids' books are just very magical, you know, uppity, meant to inspire. They get to the point. The original drama is just a very uplifting story. <laughs> so today we're going to be reviewing Lupita Nyong'o's book, Sulwe. But before we begin, if you like what you see and you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification bell. It'll always let you know when my videos are being uploaded. Let's get to it. So this book centers on a little girl having very dark skin, the darkest in her family. And so being different makes her feel sad. She tries all of these remedies. She tries erasing like her skin. She tries putting in her mama's makeup. She tries eating only like light colored foods. She even tries praying. And I'm like, Ugh. one night a shooting star visits her in her room. She goes with the shooting star and she tells her a story story about two sisters daylight and nighttime and that everyone loved the daytime they were giving her like beautiful names they were like oh my gosh it's so wonderful and when it came time to nighttime they were like oh that's nighttime is scary it's bad they weren't as loving to the nighttime as they were to the daytime so eventually the nighttime goes away and all there is is daytime you know they love the daytime they love the sun it was a little bit too much for them it was too hard they needed time to rest they needed a break from the very bright sun so daylight goes and finds nighttime and they bond together saying that they are one in the same that even though one is brighter the other one is also as beautiful as can be and each of them have this light a different type of light but each have a light so when daylight is being very bright and shining upon the people darkness will cover them with a little cloud and give them some relief and Sylvie's mother also encourages her that her name means star and telling her that brightness isn't in her skin it's inside of her I thought that was lovely guys. So he wakes up in the morning and feels refreshed. She feels like she is one and the same. She is beauty in the daytime, beauty at night. And she learns to love herself the way she is, radiating that brightness that is inside her. Not judging on what she looks like or comparing herself with other little girls or her family. She is a one and only star shining from the inside. This was a lovely book guys. I think every little kid should read it because nobody looks the same. And I know at the very, <laughs> when you're going to school, it can be very ruthless to look different this book makes every reader feel very special it's so beautifully illustrated guys it should definitely be read to every little kid growing up that way they feel comfortable and beautiful in their skin no matter who you are where you're coming from or where you're going brightness is inside of you it is not based on what you look like it is not even based on what people tell you or point at you it is you it is the brightness that you give and you shine on to others that makes you beautiful that makes you unique that makes Makes you a champion. <laughs> Everyone can learn a lot from reading kids books guys like for real. I mean they're straight to the point. It's like fairy tales but like way better and I love that it's always relatable guys. I mean if you're feeling pretty low just pick up a children's book and your morale will be boosted up <laughs> and you'll ever wonder like why have I never read these type of books like very encouraging, loving, <laughs> quick reads guys like what more do you want? <laughs> So thank you so much for watching guys. Give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification bell. It'll always let you know when my videos are being uploaded. And I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> Bye.